just at the moment, I think we need our spirits rising and to get angry and that's what's happened. But a lot of people are finding that they are soothing our souls by poetry. And it's, so I know I've already had one poet, but we've now got another poet who's been uh, doing his own poetry and he's just going to do one short poem. We won't be long because the rain is coming and we've got to march, but let's go. Thank you so much. So it's the first time I'm going to be performing. But I, yeah. Okay, this is my spoken word. I go by the name of Kilo Grammar. This is for Palestine. Okay, so do you not see the brutality? Is it not within your capacity? The stress is putting pressure on my capillaries and the press puts pressure on minorities. Palestine's experiencing atrocities. Thousands dead and endless casualties. It's a bloody calamity. Many children suffering, same with families. It's sickening. This is an astronomical tragedy. How can you or I live happily while military forces breaking laws? There's no humanity. Israeli campaigns invading with cold-blooded infantries. Pro-Israel spokespeople speak with hostility. Evading questions casually, lying on TV, talking flippantly about reality. The real misery isn't electricity. It's that the world is not shocked from these killing sprees. Family trees uprooted and scattered. How do you expect them to turn over a new leaf? Blown up into smithereens, humans in their infancy. No ending to these catastrophic scenes. Horrifying images witnessed hard to unsee. How do you keep your sanity? Their faith is strong, it's us who might need therapy. Using white phosphorus shows Israeli government savagery. Biological warfare with impunity, bombs destroy localities. Homes turned into rubble, carcasses and homes with cavities, hitting schools and ambulances purposely, targeting hospitals with extreme accuracy. And no, this is not a conspiracy. Spitefully, the ministry hits systematically, symptoms of anarchy increasing rapidly. My synonyms are significant definitions I use assiduously. They're pumping propaganda with consistency, humiliating consistently. It might be too late for your sympathy. Concentrate on how they elevate illegal settler communities. But Palestinians in refugee camps going through checkpoints, there's no empathy. Humans stripped of their dignity is killing me. No justice, but the wicked try to justify adding insult to injury. These days we live in infamy. How can you blame a Palestinian for thinking they have an infamy? We need clarity, we need a strategy. Maybe we're not doing enough collecting pennies from countries for charity. Chanting slogans is becoming a classic like Beethoven's symphonies. The screams and cries from this genocide will echo in eternity. Open your eyes, heart and mind, decide to be on the right side of history. Thank you guys. <laughs>